Hi, I'm Court Crossan. This is Crossan C's Monday Trends. And if you're a content creator, if you're a blogger, if you're a YouTuber, or even affiliate marketer, you wanna watch this video because it's a trend that's happening on Pinterest and on Google with essential oils. That being said, remember to like, share, subscribe. Also in the description box below, there's gonna be a link to my number one way to make money online. Click on it, get on my email list, and watch that video because it's a video that helped me and got me pointed in the right direction. I want the same to happen to you. Now, that being said, let's get to those trends. All right, so here we are. I'm looking at essential oil in Google Trends for the United States in the past 30 days for all categories. And in the past 30 days, as you can tell, it shot up quite a bit. It went from 0 to 100 in just the last few days. Now, to, uh, keep in mind, now this is not, 30 days is just in the past 30 days. Compared to what it was, it shot up 100 per like i don't know if it's 100 percent, but it shot up quite a bit now let's take a look at it let's go 12 months see what it's doing in all categories in 12 months as you can see it's uh, november december a lot of spikes but this year let's see uh, october it was on a the, around the same dates so it was on a downtrend this year it seems to be on an uptrend let's go past five years see what's going on with that oh it looks like overall it overall wow let's see overall let's go to october october shoots up and comes down and then goes back up into but it looks like this year in october it shoot up it shot up this is an unusual year for essential oils and that could be a very good thing now this is all categories not very specific but let's check out something that it's more related to let's go to beauty and fitness see this category what's it doing in the past five years okay just like the other thing it looks like a little bit of down trend but we're not living in the past let's go about this past year oh it looks like it's gonna shoot up looks like it shot up pretty well now this line right here says not all the uh, data points are um, uh, counted yet and all the data's not in so that was the past 12 months let's go 30 days maybe it'll give us a better look at it and it says it went as same as all categories beauty and fitness shot from zero to a hundred that's looking pretty good let's go to health health Ooh, interesting in health it just shot down real bad essential oils in the past 30 days on google people are like nah that's okay Wow, that's the thing. I thought essential oils, because what I saw on Pinterest, you'll see later that essential oils are killing it when it comes to like people and their coughs and stuff. So and when it comes to health, I was expecting it to do the same thing. I guess not. So it looks like essential oil and beauty and fitness is going crazy. Okay, this is past five years, not giving us a good idea what's happening right now. Let's go 12 months. All right. Nothing happening in travel because people are traveling let's go to the past 30 days what's going on here nope travel not that good so all right so it looks like in beauty and fitness essential oils is a, a thing essential oils is doing pretty good now that so if you're a blogger and you have a beauty and fitness how essential oils might be a topic that you want to uh, really look at now to get a better idea on things, I like to check more than one platform. So this is a search term, but a lot of people now, especially millennials, are going on to social media platforms and a really good one that's really easy to use and get a, gets a good idea, especially if your uh, demographic that you're promoting to is women because most of the people that use Pinterest are a female demographic. Now, I uh, didn't do the real broad one of essential oils because it was just too much, but this is pretty good pretty good eh? no this one's pretty good so it's um uh, so this is pinterest trends and it's in uh, you just click on your analytics and trends and you can do your own research now essential oils is the broad term so it's probably like 90 percent of the time the broad term like is just going to have way too many searches and it's going to you're not going to get a good idea what's going on so i go for a little bit more long tail uh, search terms now this is really interesting because the ones I found that are having huge spikes in interest for the platform of Pinterest is 
essential oils for allergies, colds, and coughs. Now that's pretty cool. Um, I think that's uh, really interesting because these can be all uh, content that you create. These can be YouTube videos, how to's. Uh, one of them's like for blends or for beginners. This is really cool. You see these trends, um, they're shooting up just at the same time. Like it's just a common trend for this essential oil, especially on Pinterest. And a cool thing about Pinterest is if you're a blogger, you can write a blog and promote it on Pinterest. If you're a YouTuber, same thing. If you're an affiliate marketer, you can actually promote on uh, Pinterest and get sales, say, from Amazon and stuff like that if people want recipes, how-to books, uh, things like that. So that being said, I hope this helps you with your trends and getting followers on, say, uh, Pinterest, Instagram, whatever, uh, Google, YouTube. Remember, YouTube is part of Google so that this trend is not only happening on Pinterest, which you can actually promote your uh, Pinterest, uh, your YouTube channel on Pinterest to get even more views on your YouTube channel and get more and more exposure. Uh, hopefully your video goes viral. I'm Core Cross and this is Cross and C's. Remember to like, share, subscribe. Hope this helped. Remember the, yeah, click on the link below my number one way to make money online. If you're really interested in starting your own online business, 